Alright, we're gonna try this one more time. We're gonna try making a video where we talk about Mewtwo and Connor will ruin it again. Pick your character, Connor. Try not to ruin it too hard. Can you figure out who you want to play? Oh. Made some customs. Dundon Link. Chrono Man. Thought it was pretty cool. But, uh... Mewtwo is released today. For those of us who <laughs> got our Club Nintendo accounts Three, banned. Two, one, go! So Connor, you played a little bit of Mewtwo. What did you think of it? Okay, you make me look like an asshole. Start talking. Yeah, I didn't like when you were being annoyed. I improvised like the game grumps and all of a sudden I'm a dick. You were being a dick. That's not up for debate. Well, then you're a retard. You were intentionally being a dick. Um, I was intentionally trying to get more subs so we could make money out of those videos and become 100 million years. I only have seven dollars in my pocket. I do. I have fucking pennies, I see. I have fucking pesos. I wish I was angry, you know, but he's not even supposed to be a racist or anyone but him. There's this guy named Caesar at my school, that's some girl I had to sit by and play. So that was really hot. Really, it's just some creepy looking mask. Okay, that made me super racist. That was, that was oddly racist. But you know, it doesn't matter. Uh, what did you think you of cheated. Mewtwo in your brief time playing? You fucking cheated, you cost hungry motherfucker. Mewtwo's a pretty light character. He has some interesting qualities, though. He's very slippery, very powerful. He's got a lot of good air. Yeah, moves. I think he's fun, but I mean, Caesar, if you want, he's pretty high. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to go to stage select. I was gonna say that was really bogus of you. But besides that, um. I'm just kidding. One of the more interesting things I've noticed about Mewtwo is that he does get a uh, slight boost. Did they take away the thing where it kind of says what speed you were last time? Because now. Cause that wasn't in the Wii U version. Yeah, it was. That was only in the Wii U version. But Mewtwo's pretty interesting. His, what his, the fucking um, car? That's gay as fuck. Side Why do they add all these? You know what? I'm gonna get on brief rant. His side B actually gives him a little bit of lift. Why the fuck do they have all these stupid, like, instant kill shits on fucking Super Smash Bros. Fucking now. It kinda wrecks what the game was meant to be originally, but it's fun. It kinda takes away a lot of that. I don't know where the game is going to play. I don't mean that in like an offensive way, but I mean, like, when Pro Man could not kill you, well, I think that was a good thing. Shit was not Proto Man, I was a Black Man, whatever. Both red and black. I'm not sure if you're being sarcastic, but if you want, yeah. we can play Final Destination that might be. I'm not saying that, I'm just saying take out the gay items. You know. Get it with the Final Smash fucking allowed you to uh, kill a guy in one hit, and that's fine, because that would come to once, maybe twice a match. But, like when Proto Man kills you in one hit, you should take any different fucking direction. I get fucking spanked this whole fucking day. I haven't even come close to a one match. You can try and dodge it. I've been okay. Yeah, I've been doing tactical retreats the whole time. No, don't tactical retreat. Use the shield dodge. The shield dodge is crazy over Well, I don't play like a fag. I play like a fuck. Shit. Holy shit! Your bow shoots his bow with 
such a force that in physics terms it would be <laughs> cool <laughs> nigga what? God, you're such a cool. <laughs> I'm just speaking. Don't go any further with it. <laughs> I'm not. It's just so I would say maybe on the board. I also have to get my ass fucking spanked. Because what? So Proto Man kills me no matter what, but I get the fucking rarest fucking item and it doesn't hit even if I'm literally fucking punching it hits. <laughs> you could have just avoided this in ten minutes. No, I mean it was hard to avoid because he was shooting in a thousand oh, different goddamn directions. Same trucks just go around and fucking hit cats. <laughs> I've been in a truck where someone just smashed the turtle because he saw it and he thought it'd be fun. I was in the truck because my buddy Joey was getting a ride with this thing. He was fucking a dick face. If I had a gun, I would have shot on the save that turtle. I would have killed him. Turtles don't have much to live for, but I don't think it's fair that you can just take their life for fun. Three, two, one, go! Well, that's my rant of terrible turtle murdering. This just came out, right? This was on Mewtwo, or have I played with that one once? I forgot about it. No, this was unlocked when I just unlocked it recently. Oh, I was gonna say. But, I but it, was a, it was a stage in Pro. Yeah, I know. I like nope. Well, first it's one it's similar to the one in Melee. The one in Melee is Pokemon Saving 1, this is Pokemon Saving 2, and it's I mean, it was similar, I even mean, fucking specified it's similar. Yeah, after I called you, I'm getting tarred. <laughs> well, I fucking knew the difference. I've played it all before. I've played this game like three times for some reason. I'm just too lazy to play any games anymore, so I'm fucking. Fucking bullshit, dude. I fucking made Call of Duty 3 in my game dev class. They don't have the right to do Call of Duty 3. Black Ops 3. Like, I fucking made it to game dev studio. It's a Doom mod. Really good. You kill, like, you kill, like, Soviet Russia version of Hitler. His name is Stalin.
See ya, motherfucker, is basically gold bean. Yep, yep, that was fucking niggerish. I mean, <laughs> I meant a lot of things. I meant actually, I meant my cage. I'm fucking tired. This one's gonna have to be very centered. Believe it or not, this is the least. This is the, 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 the most appropriate of the three, <laughs> three attempts. And this is the one we're sticking with. Why? Well, you better kill Mass if you kill me. Well, I kind of don't suck at Smash Bros. I don't think that's better. I don't think that's true. Yeah, I actually am. Maybe a long time ago, but you haven't really played Smash 4. I'm better. I don't think that's true. You can make shit up. I don't care, because I just did that and I basically won without even a hitch. I don't know if you've ever heard of Anal Rape Annihilation 420. <laughs> The amount I made a lot. <laughs> I'm joking. That was it. That was it. Zip on them. Yeah, you literally. I like you too. Oh shit. And we also have Lucas on the way. Lucas comes out in like a little over a month. Is it effective for me to say my balls are stinky? <laughs> We have Lucas coming in just over a month. We have, um, supposedly Roy and Ryu, or are you going to pick a character? I'm trying to fucking choose one. Sometimes it takes a little fucking okay. choose. Wario! Hey, at the head! That was racist. How is that racist? You're calling Jews Mexicans now? <laughs> Back to Mario, FD! Pac-Man stage. Also known as Paint Microsoft Paint Stage. Paint's actually so fucking, like, obsolete and easy to run. You got like a quarter of your <laughs> That was kind of funny. That was kind of funny. That, was kind of funny. that one was so funny. It wasn't you just screaming like a retard song. Yeah, I didn't have your scream. The only time I screamed is when I did the Wahoo from Super Mario Sunshine. Wahoo! Wahoo! Did I get beat? Covered in shit that That's tries why to I knock like it. Because it's literally a recreation of Pac Man. Why is that not cool? Okay, that's kind of cool. But Pac Man kind of sucks too, if I'm being honest. Pac Man sucks as a character, but I think this is a fun save. You know? No, I'm just saying Pac Man is a very game. If you're a little bitch and want to play Final Destination, then I'm sure you probably fucking hate this stage. But I'm not a little what bitch. Fuck I don't fucking have a DVR account, and that's why I don't like this stage, you know? Me too, Final Smash is pretty overpowered. So, hey, what's your most you Sonic character? Uh, his name is David the Hedgehog. <laughs> his best friend is Sonic. He has the ability to, once he collects all seven <laughs> K, once he collects all seven Chaos Emeralds, he gains the ability to transform into Sonic Shadow or Silver at will, as well as my other OC, Black the Hedgehog, who uses guns. Actually, my OC is called... Of, uh, Jeremiah the Hedgehog, and basically he's the first Jewish Sonic character. He collects all seven Chaos Emeralds. He gets big, big, big feet that he can smell. <laughs> he's got a foot fetish, and he also likes baby poop. <laughs> so that's why I have a season. Not relating to me at all. I don't know if 
good fetish. Like a foot fetish. I don't have a foot fetish either. It's just my OC Sonic character. The personality made itself. I was sleeping and I became Jeremiah the Angel. I'm not even Jewish. There's basically proof that I'm not a reflection of my character anymore. My name's also not Jeremiah. I think Jeremiah could be a black dude's name too. Not as easily. Yeah, dude, Jeremiah the black dude. I don't know. Okay. Jeremiah is a pretty white name. I mean, are you trying to call Jews not white now? I'm not saying I'm you're saying racist. That black people okay, sometimes Hitler. take Jewish names. Okay, Hitler. They take Jewish names to see more. I don't know. Alright, Adolf. I'm not Hitler, dude. I read. I read Mein Kampf, and it kind of changed Mein Kampf comprehension of the Nazi party, but not in a positive way. Not completely in a positive way, I should say. I had mixed feelings after reading Mein Kampf. Sure. I got the ebook. It was read. You can actually let it get read to you on audible.com. This is not a paid for hand. Audible.com. You can get anyone to read any book for you. I had George Decay read me Mein Kampf. <laughs> I don't think George Decay would George read Decay that. read Mein Kampf, and it's just a small subscription fee. And actually, you get your first book free, and you get a free book. So while you're here, why don't you just, you know, pause this video, or pop over, you know, you can just listen to the dialogue and hear the action in the background. Why don't you pop over to Audible and look up um, Mein Kampf? Get that as your first free Audible book. You go to. Go to www.audible.com, look up Mein Kampf, and then you go to the Mein Kampf page and you select Mein Kampf read by George Decay. Um, it's actually really good. Um, I got Steven Spielberg to read it for me, too. <laughs> there was some irony, you know, because I'm pretty sure he's Jewish. But he did it in like, kind of like a, a critical tone, I think. You don't want a director's commentary to, like, don't listen to Steven Spielberg because he sounds like a dick while doing it. Um, the other thing I do want to point out about Mein Kampf is it's about 48-hour read. It's because Hitler wrote it in his nine months of prison. Not a short one, so if you have a long car ride or something, if you're driving from, Air, from like, uh, from like Guatemala to Arizona or something, Mein Kampf might be the story for you. So, audible.com slash Mein Kampf slash George Decay. I don't even know where to go from there. That was just a plug. That was pretty good. Completely that unpaid was... for plug. Uh, you that was can make pretty good. the check out to Nigawat number one. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, pick your character. Luigi! 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 <laughs> While we're doing this, this is not brought to you by Pizza Hut. You know, eat the sticks. But I do like Pizza Hut. <sighs> you know what I'm gonna do after this, Aiden? I'm gonna go to audible.com slash my com. That's 48 What do you use for your free audible trial? I got a copy of Stalin's book, Mein Kampf in Russian. <laughs> mein Kampf Russian edition. He's like, one time I killed all I of got my Mussolini's own version called the, you know, like the, the Italian, the dictator that kind of compared to Hitler and Stalin at least. Just <laughs> killed less people. I think most of the things he did was like Serbian, killing Serbian people and shit. Actually, well, that was the Russians too. Stalin did that too. They worked together, but I mean, I think it was like 1937, and he killed Serbians or something. No, but he Hitler was a little cheese that a lot of his uh, his his Germany was kind of broken up into pieces and made into several new countries after World War One. You know, Japan was kind of cheese that their colonies weren't fully like shared or whatever. They didn't get as much of the cake as they thought they were going to make, so I mean, they were kind of fucking pissed about that. And that's what uh, watching, watching World War II HD in color episode 1 does for you. 
That was basically a description, and you can actually get the transcribed version on Audible.com, right by George Takei. It's actually uh, about 48 minutes long, a little less than my mom. But um, if you're a history buff, then you're definitely going to want to watch that. It's also on YouTube. Most of the History Channel's documentaries are on YouTube. That's where I watch all my episodes of Counting Cars. Not that I was paid by Counting Cars or anything, but um, History Channel is actually a great source for history. Another they do a lot of history too. documentaries. They do. That's another good source and for a lot history. Of is just subscribe to History HD local dish network. Yeah. It's actually kind of nice because his H2 History 2 on um, if you get direct T or if you get Dish Network, you don't have to pay for History 2 separately. Like you actually do have to um, if you get Direct TV, and that's a big problem with Direct TV. Um, Direct TV is definitely inferior to Dish Network by far, and I don't mean that in an offensive way. We're not plugging any channels necessarily, but. Um, but if you want to watch H2, which is a lot of where you have shows like Modern Marvels, you know, for example, you know, reruns of Pawn Stars as well. <sighs> well, I'm talking about Pawn and Shit Off. Pawn America has their 2v Tuesdays. Two movies for only $2. It's a good deal. It's a decent deal. That doesn't include any release. Um, so, I mean, if you can find Mein Kampf, put it on DVD, at Pawn America, all the better. I was not paid by the neo-Nazis of America to plug Mein Kampf or anything, if that's what you're wondering. This is a Super Smash Bros. Brothers episode, strictly. Two chain, nigga! A version of Sonic, but he has no chance. <coughs> he just has a lot of bling. Sonic's not cheap. He's oh, dang, fast. nigga. Hey! Brought to you by Kanye. I mean, not brought to you by just by coincidence. By Kanye's new album featuring songs like Only One and All Day. How long did Kanye spend at the mall? Day? All day. Nigga. It's all day, nigga. That's what we're doing. Read the fucking script. All day, nigga. Oh, fuck. I only have seven dollars in my damn pocket because it fucks up all of our ads. Seven pesos in my pocket. <laughs> Sonic, nigga. Are you excited for the new Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games? Oh, yeah, yeah, the next Olympics is. I'm gonna be there holding the 2016 Olympics, dude. Their opening night to pick up Mario and Sonic at the Olympic I'm gonna wear games. my Olympic Games Letterman jacket. I want a letter in being at the Olympics. My high school Letterman jacket is fucking laying down. All of them are the all of them are the really badass letters, like academic achievement, you know. Okay, guess what? I was in drama class. <laughs> I got on the B honor roll. Don't let Skullface fuck you. They're like, you only have one patch on your Letterman's jacket? Yeah, yeah so what? Uh, you make a fun of <laughs> of, <laughs> of theater team participant? <laughs> I played Hitler in the school's performance in my mouth. <laughs> That's my struggle in German. We actually got some critical success that we didn't even receive when we made the Seussical. Um, mein Kampf was a little more serious, you know? In the Seussical, I actually got to play, um... But I tried out to be thing number two. My argument being a black kid can play thing number two because they're twins. twins. Things this doesn't make <laughs> sense. Well, I was gonna say the things are white. <laughs> it's like whipped cream, dude. You add food coloring to whipped cream, it's no longer white, you know. <laughs> so if you add color to the things, then they're no longer, they're no longer white. No, that was a CD, and you fucking pulled it away from me. 
It's still there. Devil World. Oh, no, it didn't. It faded away. But this Pokeball is still here. Let's see what's in it. Never mind, it just fell off the board. It's down. Oh no, it wasn't easy. It's just. I got it. They said, hey, down guess the street. what, Connor? You can play the narrator. So I did George to Boys because that's what they wanted me to do. I played my part, and um, the newspaper actually said I was by far the worst part of the performance. They said I can't say the phrase Nickelodeon yeah. on stage. Unfortunately, Fuck. I did kind of drop the ball on that performance. I go. Leave me alone. And my cat ran away too, so Sonic I'm coming. So that's another con. <laughs> Fuck! Oh my you god. You killed yourself, dude. Ow, oh, Nate, nigga. Yeah! I had two lives left because I'm better than Aiden. No, because you. Aiden sucks, life. dick! Well, guys, I think that's it for our Smash Bros. video. I'll see one more. Tune in for a video one more. To prove that I'm better than you. Fine. Nigga Watt is now CPU one. Fine. Also, we have to finish, um, not this. Not this, but, uh, oh. for Smash Bros, we have to finish, um, the, uh... Also, not that we're paid or anything, but put Nigga Watt one into the keyword section of audible.com and get 26% off your first order. We have to do the co-op events sometime. It's 26% off your school first school order school. because one Nigga Watt is the equivalent of 2.166 volts. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Remember, Nigga Watt one.